Hi folks, this is Jay. Hope you're okay today. I um, I do want to just get on being a preacher, and I am a fighter, and I never ever ever give in. So I'm going to dispatch these uh, hardcore atheists with a video that is so strong and so clear, so evidential that it will make their eyes water. Okay. But I'm forced to do this because these atheists will not give in. And um, if they won't give in, I'm going to have to do this video. And they will not like this video. But this video is a video that has to be done. Alright. Now I want to get on preaching the word of God. And I want to get on serving the Lord. And if anybody wants to come down to the Socratic Club and wants to learn about Christianity you're more than welcome to do so and if you want to contact me I'm here now we've got a, a few atheists on here there's about eight or nine that have been coming on here a long time one of them supposedly, uh, supposedly an academic or top academic now this nine or so atheists that have come on here have had this rhetoric of being saying that I am no good. I am no good. Me, Jason, no good. And that they're very clever, all right. And then at the same time, we've had um, some atheist YouTubers out there, a number of them saying, um, you know, we don't want nothing to do with Jason. Don't debate him or anything. Or talk to him. Okay. Here's the question: <clears throat> If I'm so bad, okay. And if I am so illogical, and if I uh, don't know what I'm talking about, then why have you, eight and nine specifically atheists, nearly on every video, stalked me and tried to counter those videos with your arguments? why I tell you why number one you're unbalanced it's not normal to be following a man round who makes videos after videos a thousand videos and every video that he makes out of a thousand videos you're there making your comments and stalking him every day and not every day some of you claim to be uh, very clever people and working one of you claims to be a top academic and yet you don't seem to be doing any academic work and you don't seem to be doing anything but following me and commentating under my videos which shows an unhealthy lifestyle to to say the very least but on top of that shows you're not doing much academic work so atheist why have you been stalking me brutal question I know but if I'm so bad why every video have you had to try and make comments and argue against me? If I'm so bad, why have you been stalking me? Oh, you say, it, to laugh at me. Well, if it's to laugh at me, why do you try to keep arguing against me? You see, you're not being honest. You see, you're like snakes, atheist. You're like vicious snakes. Vicious snakes. Vicious snakes. That's all you are, is vicious snakes. Vicious and nasty. All right. I'm stronger than any of you atheists out there, especially those nine that have been following me. I'm stronger, and I'm a bigger man. All right, I'm a bigger man, and I'm not getting involved with your um, perversion of Jay that you have. You've got a perverted attitude towards me. You can't seem to live without me. You've got to be making comments against me. You've got to be coming on and watching my videos all the time. And it's, it's, uh, it's perverted. There's some kind of perverted mentality going on in your brain. You don't come like once a week. You don't come on my channel once a week and listen to me. You don't listen to a video once a week or once a month. You're on every day. And it's not during the day. It's during the day and night. These are eight or nine hardcore atheists. And one of them supposedly an academic. 
This is not normal activity. It's not normal. All right. It's very, very abnormal. Now, some of you say, "Well, Jason, you show an abnormality because you've uploaded a thousand videos in over five weeks or whatever." Yes, about five hundred of them are from uh, Christian preachers who, who preach, and I have permission to put them up. So I put them up. So they're not me. All right. It's not me preaching. There's 500 videos. And then secondly, the other 500 are to make up. When I was on Zwema 100, we had over 2,000 videos, but the atheists were attacking us so much, I had to take 600, 600 of my videos of me, me, off, because the channel was getting attacked so much, it would get pulled down, and a lot of work was done, and I didn't want that channel to get pulled down. But the atheists were that close to destroying that channel, getting it uh, DMCA'd and off air, uh, etc. So I pulled 600 videos off and I calmed things down and I came here. I lost 600 and I wanted to make them up. That's why. And I've got the time and I and because I had the time and it's my time, I put I I worked hard and I put those videos. I made those videos up about 500 on here, okay, to make up for the loss that I'd lost on another channel. So you've got no excuse, um, atheist, for me making all the videos that I did, because I needed to get them back up to strength, because I'd lost 600 because of your hate mongering. So basically, keep stalking me, atheist. That seven, eight, nine atheists keep stalking me and show your continue to show your abnormal behavior because it is not normal, all right, and it's certainly not the behavior that a man who is supposedly, i.e., me, doesn't know what he's talking about, supposedly doesn't know what he is saying or what he is reading, and yet. And yet, you're trying to argue against me all the time. That is illogical and inconsistent. Someone who's deluded or someone who's crazy or someone who is doesn't know what they're talking about, you ignore them. You don't look them up every day and try to argue with them. If you do, you're showing that really you respect them and that they've got something about them that you're trying to challenge. And that's the case. I've been saying things that have challenged you and you've not liked it and you've kept fighting me. But in your fighting you've shown some kind of unusual strange behaviour in doing it every day. So I would call you stalking atheist. Brutal video I know atheist. But you deserve it. You deserve it. Okay. You don't try to cut my head off. Alright. Don't try to cut my head off because it won't work. All right, and they can go on about they pawn me this and they pawn me that. They edit videos and they manipulate videos. But the biggest liars on YouTube, the atheist community, the biggest twisters you'll ever meet in your life. You can never pin them down. You can never get a decent conversation with them. You can never get it right with them. They're always manipulating. They're always trying to manipulate you. You can never have a proper academic debate ever in a million years. And I said once, oh well, if you want to do a, a, a scrappy debate, but deep down when I said that, I didn't mean it. I, I believe, ultimately, in a much higher way of conducting oneself, really. Okay? I believe in proper academic debates. You never get that with atheists. Why? Because they're nasty, trickery people who just try to play tricks and nasty things. Atheist on here pretending to be my friend and then they just turn round today and be nasty towards me. See, two-faced. They're always two-faced, these atheists. Two-faced. People, atheists Skyping me and talking to me, pretending to be my friends and then trying to entrap me and being two-faced. And that's what I've had. That's what you get with these atheists. And if you were if you were honest atheist, you would go and do your research and your reading. I gave videos, 
I've given videos with articles and things in and, and you atheists never read them and never come back to me and talk about it. So you're not honest. You're not wanting to research scholarship. I did the Socratic Club and I said come and read a Muslim scholar. Not one atheist. There was 20 on that show. And not one atheist came and said they'd re read the Muslim scholar. And we had an academic come on, supposedly, and he hadn't read it. And you're a complete and utter joke. Total and utter joke you are. You're not, you're not into scholarship. And just because someone comes on and starts mouthing off and can talk German and, and talk, uh, talk in a, a sort of German accent and, and, and very logical and try to be intimidating and knows for the fact that I've prepared the show on a, on a particular area, but decides to try and get me in on an area that I've not prepared and, and, and tries to uh, pawn me and be aggressive and, I, and, I, and I'm just trying to uh, get on with a show where we're having, uh, trying to explore Islamic scholarship and this academic doesn't even come and hasn't even read the Muslim scholar and, the, and, and then you all uh, talking as if the guys are uh, pawn me, you're just talking nonsense you're talking absolute nonsense, atheist. I don't want to spend my life with this negativity that you that you pump out all the time. This stalking, this this pretending to be, be, be my friend but bitching me, bitching behind me back. This pretending to be my friend but wanting a piece of my ass all the time. You just you just two faced hypocrites, atheist. I'm sorry, you are. Two-faced hypocrites. Two-faced hypocrites. Trying to be my friend but bitching behind me back. Trying to be my friend but wanting a piece of my ass at the same time. Well, I'm sorry. You're not having a piece of my ass. Because my ass is precious. Alright? So. Stop stalking me, atheist. And if you do keep stalking me, I'll treat you as a stalker. And stalkers are not to be messed with. You just leave them alone because they've got perverted mentality. I want to meet people who are open-minded and open and interested in developing their critical thinking and looking at scholarship. That's what I want to be with. That's what I want to do. I'm not the best debater, but I can hold my own with anybody, okay, when I've prepared my topics, okay, and done my research. But what I won't hang around with is this hardcore mentality, this ma ma Machiavellian uh, political manipulation that these hardcore atheists, these hardcore atheists uh, pretend to be my friends and then they backstab me, they pretend to be my friends and bitch about me, they pretend to be my friends and try to get a piece of my ass. Take my videos, manipulate them, and play games with them, and try to make me look bad. And all I've ever wanted is honest discussion and debate with these idiots, and you can't get it because they're just sick. They're just sick in the head, fanatical. It's not all atheists. There are some, a very small minority. I've not met them, but there are some there that are genuine, open. But that's my experience of these atheists on YouTube. Trying to be my friend. Bitch behind me back. Trying to be my friend. Wanting a piece of me ass. That's the, that's the way they are. You cannot trust them. You cannot trust them. You cannot have a proper debate with them. You cannot have a proper conversation with them. You can't trust them as far as you can throw them, as far as I'm concerned. That's my experience. And you better run away from them and be concentrating on atheists that are open-minded and people that really want real scholarship and really engage. Not two-faced people who play two-faced games. I'm a bigger man, and this video has brought me down to their level, and I'm not doing it anymore. 
I'm a bigger man. Take care, God bless.